This book was not recommended to me by anyone. I happened upon it by reading the, uh, the Pulitzer Prize list, which I frequent each year. And so I read it, and it became my favorite book. I read it almost completely in the laundromat near my house in Montreal, and I bawled hysterically. It is such a good book. It is so sad. But not like in a sad way where like, it's not like a book about like a dad getting cancer, and then a dog getting hit by a car, and then like a baby dying or something like that. It's like just life, just plain old life. The book is about like a dad and a son, um, their relationship over the course of Independence Day weekend, and also his relationship with his ex-wife, and his and then his sort of current relationship that he's having with another woman. Uh, that appeals to me. I'm a child of divorce, so I love books about other children of divorce. Personally, I'm attracted to books that are about uh, families or intense relationship dynamics between family members. I mean, it's not like a book you read slowly over time. To me, it's like a, the book happens over the course of like three or four days. And so to me, it's like it's a book that should be read in three or four days. And so if you're not serious about this book, this is a commitment book. Don't come and play around with this book. Don't, don't leave this book on if you start it, finish it. For real.